game. Here's Chubb trying to pick his way inside the five, and he does. And the last thing any Browns fan wants to see, Nick Chubb holding his left leg. Oh, boy. We're not going to show it. It's, uh, it's, it's as bad as you can imagine. Crowd gasped. Here comes the blitz. And there goes Alex Smith down at the 40-yard line. Alex Smith is down. Oh. See Alex Smith's in a lot of pain right there. Yeah, Hands he on is. His face. This is what happened to Alex Smith. As we welcome you back to Landover, there is Alex Smith being carted off. And as you see everybody coming up, and just before that, the, the Texans bench had come over as well. We're not going to show you the replay. It's Johnny Knox. Fumble. Ball is loose. And the Seahawks have the football. And Johnny is down. I think it was Cam Chancellor, I believe. 31 right there, Cam Chancellor. The other safety gets his hand on yep. it. In there, you can't see it from that angle, and that's why Knox is still laying on the As field. As he was going down on the ground, Anthony Hargrove, the big defensive lineman, landed on top of him. 94 coming in. Afterwards, he slams head on with Knox. And you can see what happens to Knox here as he loses the ball, bends his body backwards clearly in the direction, Chris, the body's not supposed to go. Trubisky to the end zone. Touchdown from Trubisky to Miller, and Miller is still down in the end zone. Well, let's see if he finishes this catch. Left hand, left hand, holding the ball, still securing the ball. So Trubisky trusts Zach Miller as he goes up and brings it in one hand. And what happens is Mitchell Trubisky throws to a spot. To Mississippi. It's a trick play. The play's been defined by what the quarterback sees. Look at it with the reverse angle one more time, and I suggest your stomach is weak, you just don't watch. And we'll look at it with the reverse angle one more time, and I suggest your stomach is weak, you just don't watch. Joe Theismann never played another down of football. Prescott breaks the tackle. He picks up a total of nine more. Oh, no. Oh, no. Uh, oh, no. And look at Gallup reacting and Dalton getting ready to go in. Mm. Oh, you know, one of those you don't want to see twice. You saw it going the break. Dak Prescott's right ankle, right foot. Check uh, in on his former quarterback. You hate for any team in the National Football League to lose their quarterback, and hopefully it's not something that's. I mean, you have no idea right here. You just feel for. He's a great kid, and I know a lot of people love him in the organization. I've been around him. You can tell by his face, he knows that it's not something small. Kid right there has never missed a start, Jim, his entire career. Kaepernick passes incomplete and no flag is thrown. John Baldwin looked like he had well, they're in man coverage underneath, and they're certainly the right hand was on the shoulder to pull on the jersey. And it's Greer who can't get up. And it's not a pretty picture. The left knee and ankle. And so he has not been able to get up. And now this Saints defense on third down has 15 consecutive stops. Watch what happens. Kelly makes a great athletic tackle. But unfortunately, this is a turn away if you don't want to see this. Phillips' leg snaps. Clean tackle, a, a good play by Kelly, but boy, everyone obviously concerned on hopefully Anthony Phillips. Bo Jackson has some room. One man to beat, and from behind, Kevin Walker saves another touchdown. Bo Jackson shaken up a bit, has not uh, gotten to his feet as yet. That was a 34-yard run by Jackson. In the final analysis, he's been making all kinds of plays. He's pulling on that leg, and it could be that he just pulled a muscle that Bo did trying to pull away. Here, uh, see Cobb on the field now. Here is the fullback, a pro bowler last year, Leonard Weaver, good for one. And now Leonard Weaver is injured. 
nasty injury to the left leg of Leonard Weaver. A huge hand for Leonard Weaver, who had a brilliant season. 15 times, two touchdowns, and just a gruesome injury to that left knee. They're going to put it in the air. Oh, the intended receiver is Darrell Stingley. The man he ran into is Jack Tatum. And Stingley was down. It was a Stingley just didn't get up. Tatum's hit turned Stingley, a budding star wide receiver, into a quadriplegic. Third and two. Burrow hit on a release, puts an arrow under it. Near side for Boyd. Burrow, oh boy. Clutching his left leg. Uh -oh. Looks like the left knee that they're looking at. And Burrow, as they continue to check out Burrow, has just been carted into the Bengals locker room. It is the left leg. Every player, a couple of days past the two-year anniversary of that horrific Alex Smith injury with the right leg. That his season is over. One more look at it. Oh, man, that's tough. Look away if you don't uh, uh, want to see those type of injuries. This burger from the pocket. Middle of the field, incomplete. First look. Oh, a flag does come in. Went to the head in field goal range. Perfect was in there, too. Personal foul, defense number 55, 15-yard penalty, automatic first down. Perfect in the end. It seemed like two Vontaze Whoa. perfect, and yes, okay. that's going to be suspension, fine. Of course, flagrant. Oh. It's a slant route thrown a little bit high by Eli Manning. Oh, and you can see that left ankle. The larger concern now for Beckham. Both these teams are trying to win a game. It's still hasn't caught a pass. Had 19 coming in. And they still On the cart, clutching that left ankle area. Now the emotional roller coaster. Stop. Pass is caught, but short of the first down, the ball is out. This is not reviewable. So this could be another bad break. Get pinned underneath, and it might have been at that moment that he lost the football. Bowman's the guy that forced it. He's got the ball right there, right in his.